Okay, Tony, thank you. A big political announcement taking place this afternoon in Grand Rapids. Oakland County Sheriff Mike Bouchard is naming Secretary of State Terry Lynn Land as his running mate. Bouchard is one of several Republicans running for governor. Land dropped out of the race in June and threw her support to Bouchard at that time. Political reporter Rick Alvin asked Bouchard about the possibility of picking her as a running mate. Here's what he had to say then. First of all, I think, you know, we're all Michiganders, and regardless of where they came from or where you come from, it's important to have somebody that reflects your values and can get the job done. Uh, I was an active supporter of Dick Postumas, an active supporter of Dick DeVos. Uh, I don't care where you live. If you're going to fix Michigan, I'm happy to support you, number one. Number two, um, I think as you talk about a ticket, uh, certainly, you know, it's important to find somebody not just geographically balanced, but somebody who has the ability, knowledge, and skills to do important things on behalf of the constituency. And so um, obviously there's a number of folks that do fit that bill. Certainly uh, one that would be and should be on anybody's short list is, is standing here um, without question. That was the answer in June, and Rick Albin joins us now. Rick, your thoughts on today's announcement? Well, there are a couple of things. One is it's not a complete surprise, obviously, at that press conference. We talked about it then, and it was there was at least uh, in the circles of people who talk about politics thought that this was ability. It is a little bit early. Okay. We were talking about yeah. that early. You don't always make these kind of announcements before you get the nomination. and Sometimes this goes right down to a convention. But I think that there is some good reasoning for this because you've got such a crowded field out there right now. It is crowded and there are a lot of people in the race already early and you kind of expect that to kind of drop off in the weeks ahead, months ahead? I think it's possible. Mm -hmm. you, we've already seen obviously the Secretary of State dropped out and with that many people, remember this is going to be a difficult time too. It's going to be difficult for people to raise money. Yes. We've already seen that political contributions are down. Uh, these are very expensive. We're talking about multi-million dollar campaigns. Somebody told me yesterday that for one state senate race they expect four million dollars. Mm -hmm. So if a state senate race costs that, a run for governor is going to be very expensive. So if those contributions aren't coming in, I think that could be a problem. Talk about the east-west connection. Very interesting. This is what I put on my Twitter page. I said this will balance this ticket or potential ticket east-west and then I ask, how important is that? By the way, you can go to our Twitter page. It's Rick Albin, all one word, lowercase. First person to retweet on that, Secretary of State Terry Lynn Land. So I'd like to know, how important is it? You know, a lot of the problems in this state politically appear to have an east-west divide. Yeah. You have an Oakland County Republican sheriff who is running at the top of the ticket. If he does indeed get the nomination, you'll have uh, the west side from, from uh, Kent County, former uh, county clerk, secretary of state. So that is good geographic balance, but how important is that? I'd like for our viewers to tell us again. Rick Albin, all one word, lower uh, case at Twitter. And we'll, uh, at Twitter. we'll talk about that later today. Okay, hey, all thanks, right. Rick. Thanks.